you're watching Dance On, my name is Luan Legacy and thanks for tuning in to another episode of your weekly Smash Recaps. This episode was one that you definitely didn't want to miss. We start off by finding out that Karen and Ivy both have an audition for a National Orange Juice commercial. Seems like these two just can't stop running into each other. Ivy shows up late, but just in time to bump into Karen and hear the director say that she's perfect and she lands the job. Ivy, sad news, but uh, you're cut. Ivy's less than excited to be back working in the course for the show Heaven on Earth, but for her, it must be hell on Earth because, girl, during the performance, she was over it. Everybody had these cheeky smiles on stage and she was just dry, just, just deserts on her face. Frank finds some suspicious lyrics about a love affair while Julie is away, and when she comes home, he really lets her have it. Despite her attempts to apologize, he says that she has betrayed him, their son, and 18 years of marriage. He even goes on to find Michael and gives him a piece of his fist. Frank is vicious. Remind me not to cheat on him, although you shouldn't be cheating at all. Cheating is bad. Behind the set of another Heaven on Earth performance, Ivy decides to take one anxiety pill too many and she has a complete meltdown on stage. I mean, she's singing out of tune, changing the choreography, and even takes a stumble to the floor on stage. So tough to watch. I don't know how Karen did it. Oh yeah, Karen saw the whole thing. And you can only imagine how Ivy felt when she found out that Karen witnessed the whole thing. The two argue for a bit, but then decide to find some common ground, and what else can you do at that point? Drink. They wander the streets of New York a little buzzed, and even do a street performance of I'll Drink to That. These two can have a good time together. What's going on? April Fool's was on Sunday. The show closes with Julia meeting up with Michael to let him know that Frank has left the family. She tells him not to apologize, and the two part ways. In the aftermath of it all, Tom and Julia finally decided on the name for the musical. Bombshell. So much good drama, such a good show. If you guys aren't watching it yet, you really should. With that being said, this has been Luan Legacy. You're watching Dance On, and tune in next week for another episode of your Smash Recaps.